Okay, we're learning um, West Coast Swing Technique. Um, we talked about a lot of little things today. We talked about staying in the slot. Um, no matter where the man goes, stay in the slot and let him adjust. We talked about three different timings. I'm going to show the ladies part. Sugar push timing, walk, walk, tap, step, triple step. A pass timing, I'll do it in this direction. Walk, walk, triple step, triple step. Whip timing, which is walk, walk, triple step, walk, walk, triple step. There's slight variations to those. Um, then we did a move, a uh, basket whip, that was whip timing, walk, walk, try to do a pass, because he's gonna get out of your way, but then he should stop you and bring you back. It makes the footwork a uh, forward coaster, which we didn't talk about that word today. Then he should send you back for the next walk, walk, triple step. There's different kinds of triples you can do. Then we talked about um, how the knees allow the hips to move um, differently and in a sexy way. So we talked about putting pressure on a bent knee and then trading the knees. Pressure on a bent knee, that means I'm taking a step and trading the knees. We did that a little bit. Um, you loved it, actually. Then we did triple step with a swing-like knee styling. And what we did was a ball Full foot, ball flat. And that can be done at the end of anything. So if I did a sugar push, walk, walk, tap, step, triple step. Notice how there's a delayed change of the knees. It starts to make it look like swing instead of cha-cha or rumba. That concludes our summary of today.